All right, iPhone 6, 0.49 short. Hey, what's up everyone? This is Rafal, and today in the Solutions in a Hurry, we have an iPhone 6 that came here uh, for data recovery. It was completely dead. Uh, once I plugged a new battery in and I plugged it to the meter, it was stuck at 0.49 amps. Um, I had a similar situation a few weeks ago and uh, after removing the booster IC uh, for the backlight, the short disappeared and the phone boot up. So I went ahead and did the same here. Once I removed the booster IC, uh, one of the pads um, lifted and I'm not sure if it is it my fault or was it burned. The VF for that uh, one pad was uh, kind of burnt, looked burnt to me. Um, and that was uh, that, it's this pad here. Um, and this one connects straight to the CPU and PMIC. Uh, now both of them were getting very, very hot. So I figured, uh, let me give me, I figured I would replace the PMIC. Uh, after that, no change, 2.49 amp draw. So I start poking around uh, all capacitors, one, you know, 1V8 and all those. And uh, eventually I, I spotted a um, short on PP3V0 NAND. Um, and after visual inspection, one of the capacitors was actually burned. So I removed that one and the short disappeared. And uh, now the phone actually turns on. <laughs> there you go. So uh, this was a successful repair. Um, there is no backlight, of course, um, but we don't need that for that recovery. Um, I'm surprised that 0.49 before was on the booster uh, IC, which has completely different lines. I hope this video was helpful. Like it, subscribe, and I'll catch you later in the next one.